Hey everybody, well, I'm Milky Marsh, welcome back to 60 Seconds. This game, from what I've seen on the internet, you can't beat it. So, let me begin. Apocalypse scavenge run. I don't know what's the difference between all of them. Apocalypse. Fat man. 60 seconds. Okay. And begin. I'm gonna begin on Fat Man. I've never played this game before. I haven't even done the intro. So let's see how well this goes. I'm pretty sure people have never beat it. Okay. Man, why is the mouse so bad? Okay, a few things I need to find is my my boy ah the handbook. And cards. I got cards. Yay, wham, thump. Throw everything in there. Um flashlight. Uh axe. Where is my the uh, there's my uh shoot uh padlock. Uh go, 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 go. Um I need my probably need my wife and daughter. And boom. And wife, come here. Oh, there's a map there. I probably need the map. Come on. Uh, give me need, need the map. Oh, I need the radio. Shoot. Where's the radio? Give me the, where's, where's the radio? Um. Where's the where's the radio? I can't see the radio. I can't seem to find the radio. I've got a gun. Ah, oh, I didn't get any water. No. Ah. Oh, wait, what? I didn't even make it to my. Okay. Well. I've completely failed. I probably should have done the tutorial. That might have been a good idea. Well then, this is... Oh well. Okay. So, I need to get... Well, my guy's dead. Oh well, I didn't get the radio. I didn't get any food or any water. I didn't get the gas mask. You perished. Oh. Okay. They survived one. I didn't even survive one day. I didn't even survive the bomb. Okay. Hey, I'm Milky Marsh. I totally didn't die once already. Let's try this for the very first time. No tutorial. I probably should do a tutorial. Tar Bomber. Little boy. Uh, every day. Unwanted visitors. Okay, begin on. Okay, I need the handbook, radio, food, and water. Because I apparently didn't grab any of that. Okay, handbook. Where is the handbook? Um. Gas mask. Uh, briefcase. Water. Is, where's the handbook? Okay, I have no idea. Ha! Radio. And a water. Get, grab the water! Thank you. Uh, gas mask. I still don't know where the handbook is. Lock. Another water. Uh, can I, does, it, does it take up one space? Yes. Uh, wife. Map. I need, I need, where's the... Where's my... Uh, come here, you. And another water. I need food. I haven't got any food yet. Okay, uh, I need to get... Where's the stupid handbook? Where's this handbook? Ah, no, no, I didn't get the handbook. Ah, the handbook is the most important thing in the game, as far as I seem. I didn't get any food. Shoot. Ah, that sucks. For all injuries ranging from paper cuts to decapitations, how are you gonna come back from that? Got a gas mask at least. I'll send that little guy up. 
I know it's made in the shots just a second before the blast. That was a close one. Okay. I got oh when we opened the shelter door we noticed some of the shelves already stopped. We can't say we recall putting the supplies here, but we definitely got I got a flashlight. Yay! We don't have that much food. We don't have food at all. Plenty of water, okay. And then I've I've got a lot of water. I've got one soup. I am not gonna give anyone food because can't. Lake we've been going to, but it would be good to find ourselves there. No, we're not going there. Okay. Can I send that little guy out? Expedition. He's already going a bit. We can take care of ourselves. Everything is okay. No new troubles. <sighs> I'll wait till they get hungry. Uh, area is still radiated. This, this guy, Timmy. Timmy can go. We had the most curious visitors today. One of them was making a horse pair. One of them was making the sound of a galloping horse while using a pair of rocks and hitting them against each other, while his companion was pretending to ride said horse. They claimed to be on a very important quest to seek some magical cup, only they lost their way in the west and they asked permission to have a quick look at our map to determine their whereabouts. Don't break my map. No, I'm not. No, sorry. Hopefully, they don't take my soup. They, well, I didn't want. To, okay. We couldn't contain our laughter, and our guests took offense. They ran off, shouting that the ancestors were rodents and smelled like forest fruits. How rude! Water, nothing other than water. He should drink some. Thirsty. Where is Washer and Ted needs it? Okay, I'll give them more water. Washer. There, you've all got water. You guys can survive with food. Some of us are keen to go outside and then others other ways. Okay, that little guy. And take the guy's mask. I got bug spray for some reason. Oh, there's a bug in there. I will kill him. Kill the bug. Okay. Didn't cause any trouble. Some of out, yeah. Quite calm. Okay, everyone's okay. I'm not gonna give anyone anything. Play a game, they said. It'll be fun, they said. They never mentioned picking one would be so much trouble. Hmm, good idea. Hopefully that kid comes back with food. Because I'm in dire need of food. Uh, everything is okay with them. We thought playing the silent game would be a good idea. The silence was too annoying and we quickly stopped. Okay, you guys don't need anything. There's nothing more annoying than silence and, there's noth and that's all we're getting from our radio. No music, no talking, nothing. Is there anything we can do to with the radio to make it work again? No. Don't fiddle with the radio. We need that. For the other people. In the military. I'm gonna lock also. Okay. Be sure we're experiencing technical. Yes, that's it. Everything will be just fine. Something to drink. Okay, I'll give them more water. Pretty sure they can survive without food. How yeah, much food do they take? Uh, you know what? I'll give them food. I've got a little bit of food left. Today we've met a bunch of people dressed in what looked like Halloween doctor outfits. Uh, they claim to be a field hospital moving from place to place and attempting to help those hurt by hazards of the waste and the problem is some of their supplies got eaten by something that looked like a sasquatch. They're asking us if we have any spare hydrogen peroxide. We'll give them water. Cause... Yeah. That seems like a fair trade. Hopefully... Oh, they took two bottles of water. We asked, oh, they took one. We asked them for their doctor licenses, but all of them claimed they left them in another pair of trousers. We didn't dare ask if it was just the one pair. We gave them a water bottle and wished them a good journey, and better luck with the trousers. With trousers. Okay, everybody's fine, quite calm. Okay. He's still not back. We're still low on... We were never huge fans of mushrooms, but with a colony of them growing on one of our walls, we changed our loyalties. Yes, eat them. I hope they're fine. I think they're fine. They should be. They're just mushrooms growing on the side of you. What did he bring? He didn't, he brought he brought a soup can and the gas mask and nothing else. 
We learned something today. Tomato soup is our best friend and mushrooms aren't. Yuck. Oh no. We were so afraid for Timmy, but he came back from the wasteland and is safe. Silent wasteland is at least one resident who managed quite well. It was a proud looking monkey. We had no idea where it came from. The zoo maybe? It seemed fair. I got two soups. Yes. Uh. While exploring, while we explored one of the streets, the monkey ran away only to come back with a can of food. At that point, the monkey started making weird sounds and digging in front of us. Oh, we got a water as well. Digging in front of us with a stick. Quick investigation revealed water. No one even tried to open them. That same couldn't be said about those bottles of booze lying next to them. It's always better. Okay, everything's calm. Timmy needs food. It's today or never. Timmy is tired. Loris is fine and well as much as you know. Okay. Ted became infected with something. No. Come on. Fine. Okay. You don't need water. Ah, you, you can get water. I'll feed him all tomorrow. Yes. Sending Timmy out? Out of the question. I should send Timmy out. I want to send him out. Oh, well. It's so easy to escalate silly arguments in close quarters doesn't help. We were chatting and suddenly we were fighting and fighting this. So I will get over this. Ah, he's all sick. That's from the stupid mushrooms. Yeah, I should done it. Okay, we could barely sleep after all that arguing. Getting something to drink. Okay, they all need water. Timmy is hungry. You had food just yesterday. It's water for Dolores. Ted needs water. He has recovered from his sickness. Everyone apparently needs water. Fine. I've got I've got enough for like three more days. Can I see him out again? Ah, uh, shoot. Oh, who should I send out? I'll send her out. The gas mask. Gas mask. Um, okay, fine. Bye, Dolores. That's her name, right? Dolores. Okay. It's totally fine. To me, is hungry. You hungry all the time. No, you're not gonna eat anymore. Okay. Um, nope. So I tell me stop wondering about what's going on and start asking questions or at least listen to some reasonable answers. So how about tuning a to a radio station and... Okay, but you better not break the radio. I don't see how you can can break the radio. Is the radio still there? Please tell me the radio. Okay, the radio looks fine. I don't trust it. We are able to get a weak signal and tap into government's emergency announcement service. Guess what? Good news. The fallout outside is mostly gone. Should be much safer to travel. Okay. And Doris didn't actually need that. Oh well. Wait. Are they food? Timmy's hungry. Yeah, nothing to worry about. Okay. You don't have to eat. And I'll feed them all tomorrow. If there's anyone who can rescue us from this LA situation, it's our government. You can badmouth them all you want, but that probably means you're either a naysayer or a commie. We're good citizens, we've been paying our taxes regularly, so we sure Uncle Sam is coming to get us. Well, except for that one time when we never mind. The government people are coming and we should keep our ears in. Yes, okay. Use the radio. And here's the book, though. Don't break. Okay, the radio is fine. And the Lord's chick isn't back yet. We knew it. The government has not fallen. They're coming to save us. They didn't give exact dates in the radio, but we're sure they won't keep us waiting. Couple days. Mary Jane is thirsty. Timmy's hungry. Timmy's talking about nothing other than washer. Fine. You can all get some. No, there we were thinking it's a day like any other down here while Mary Jane conf confronted us. Uh, she said it's her birthday, but she doesn't want a gift. Not in this situation. Not in this economy. Well, she's too young to be giving orders around here, so she's getting a birthday present, and that's that. We just need to pick out something. I'm not giving her poison. She can suffer without a gift. Uh, well, she'll get soup. Ah, I should get the some soup. Shoot. That Dolores chick better be back soon. Mary Jane's too old for birthdays. That's what we think. 
Everyone's okay. That is fine. Okay, good. We have a working radio. Why not use it? Maybe we'll get yes. Always use the radio. Unless you want to fix it. Because then he's probably going to break it. He said what I'm assuming. Hey, we've got food and water. Some friend he saw on the radio was talking about a supply pack she lost during a trip during town. We immediately realized she must have driven through our street. We rushed out to and got the package before anyone else. Water and food. Uh, everyone's fine. Nothing going on with anyone. So then you guys can okay. Then you guys can just stay like that. There's one person we truly miss. It's our great uncle Terry. He used to tell brilliant stories about turtles, elephants, and wizards. Huh? I'd be sorry showing to you one of those stories again, and yet we don't even have a photo and just memories. We don't even have a handbook. We would have gotten food and water from that, I bet. I bet we would have gotten food from reading handbook. Eh, hey, but she came back with water and a food. And absolutely nothing else. Useless. We're, we are left with no photos, no news, and no happy thoughts. The world is too cruel. Yep. She's back. One of my neighbors had a boat of his own. The old time wasn't happy to let anyone use it and just kept it in his yard. It's still there, but the neighbor isn't. We finally get a chance to get a look inside. A few soup cans. Seems rich people like soup too. Soup is great. We love soup. Soup. Since the ocean is pretty salty, keeping a supply of drinking water. Yep. So, but one food into water. Everyone's thirsty. Except for. Uh, you get both, you get water, water, water. Why can't I send those two out anymore? Alright, too tired. Sing to me out, out of the question. Well, mmm, Mary Jane, I guess it's you. Uh, we stumbled upon the remains of abandoned shanty town. Someone or something tore it down. And incidentally, amidst the rubble, we found a cat. Looking at paws nonchalantly. Surrounded by blood and dismembered limbs. Wow. As we made our way back to the shelter, the cat followed. We can now hear its paws impatiently scratching our hatch. Should we let it inside? Yes. A good cat. We like that cat. I'm gonna call it Pancake or something. I don't know. There's a cat! Look at it! Oh, it's so cute! When we opened the hatch, the cat jumped in and marched around the whole shelter, sniffing all of us. Every wall, corner, empty soup can, and piece of furniture. Finally, it picked a quiet place, sat down and let out a deep sigh before taking a 12 hour nap. Wow. This color has Sherikov etched into it. What kind of name is it? What kind of a name is Sherikov for a cat? Actually, it's a pretty cool name. I won't lie, I like that name. Uh, everyone's fine uh, to me is making the best out of the situation. Yeah, she's just hungry. Nothing going on with Ted. Fine, you can eat something. Okay, and you might, you might as well drink something as well. Actually, no, you're not gonna drink anything. Yeah, you're not. You're not gonna drink anything. I'm gonna waste that water. Seems awfully quiet. Yeah, might as well. I thought I sent someone. Oh well. Oops. Whoever designed this fallout shelter was a genius, but we can't really tell if it's the green stuff dripping from the pipe is an included future. We should probably try doing something about it whenever we board with whatever. Oh, we don't have the book, so gas mask it is. Well, the gas mask is gonna break. Oh, the gas mask is fine. Oh, would you look? Hey, the cat's over here now. Cherokee. Food supply. 17. Dolores, hungry, tired, Ted, Mary Jane, Timmy, tired. How do you get untired? Hey, ha, problem solved. No leak, no mess. Back to our tidy little shelter. Okay. Uh, Timmy is on his best behavior. How long will it last? Dolores is. She needs to eat again. Ah, uh, there's much going. Okay. No. Enough sitting around. It's time to visit the surface. Okay. Her or him? Uh, I think he, the main story revolves around him, so I'm sitting here. With, no, not a checkers board. Not a gas mask, because you don't need that anymore. A map. No. No, not the radio. Not poison. Flashlight. Would that be useful? Probably not. A lock. Okay, you can go with the flashlight. Or not. I'll just send you with the gas mask. 
Okay, I don't even have a gun. Oh, I need to find that book. It's a bit of a the Sherkov. I like that cat. It's a cool cat. Are you s he's sick. How how is he sick? Uh, how did he seems to have developed an allergy to a fr he's allergic to the cat? Are you kidding me? Washes all the Lord okay. Everyone's thirsty. Okay. I don't have don't even have anything to give him. Ah, oh, that sucks. Spiders seem to be operating under the assumption that they have all the same rights to the shelter. Okay, poison him. Yep, I'm gonna poison Ah, oh, I should have saved the poison. Uh this is not going very well. Plus it's too oh. When it's us or them, there shouldn't be any reservations when it comes to choosing your arsenal. As we knew, the spiders stood no chance against one lame but killing spray. So we used it. In reserve, the few remaining spiders played. We started cleaning up and claimed an unexpected prize. A soup can that we know didn't notice before. It was well hidden in the shadows under a few layers of dead spiders. Disgust. Timmy should eat. Loris is for... Okay. Ted keeps going. Yes, I don't have a medical supply. Timmy, you... No. You have to eat. I don't have to drink. It seems the whole shelter has been shaking every couple of minutes and it feels like it's getting stronger every time it's yeah it comes again and it's way worse. It's an earthquake. Hold on to okay, the radio. Radio is more important. Ah uh, please don't die, Ted. Well the flashlight's broken. Minus a flashlight. Timmy is hungry. Dolores is resting. Ted hasn't recovered. Ah, uh, okay. I don't think you're gonna recover. I think he's just gonna die. Sherikov is still a fresh addition to our little family, so we need to keep an eye on it. Believe it or not, just today we noticed something else from this collar. It seems to be a metal plate with an address. And it's not far. Should we take a quick trip and see what's there? Yes. And then the cat will follow you and we'll get rid of the cat. And Tim will be all fine. No, no, the cat's gone. Before we reach the end of our street, we were stopped by two men wearing dark coats and stylish hats. They rushed towards the cat to pick him up, saying they'd been looking for him for a while now. Supposedly, Sherikov belongs to an old lady who's rather fond of it, and misses the little guy dearly. We showed him back to the shelter. The cat didn't seem to care, so why should we? Good thing we didn't get too attached to it in the last few days. Uh, right now, we should get him some water. 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 You guys are all just thirsty. Fine. Hey, yeah, drink up. Music from radio stopped to listen to transmission from the army. Halfway to the door and they started talking about evacuation. All the survivors asked to leave a sign that we were alive somewhere in the area. The exact location was given a G Okay. Well, good thing we got a map. Don't break the map. Probably gonna break the map. Hey, he's back. She's back. Did she bring anything at all? No, it doesn't look like it. You, you saved the stupid thing. Quick launch the map gives all the information. Okay. Okay, to washer. Cultists decided they won't be needing any holy water. We did a bit of miracle work and turned empty wine bottles into quite full water bottles. Oh, wait. Uh, expedition reached a church which is still standing. Most of it was intact, and some people decided to turn it into a shelter. As you find out, was more than that. We weren't sure the religion they followed, but they were very good to convince us that tomatoes are the source of all evil and eggplants are the only hope for salvation. Those guys are insane. One of the beds. Oh, we got a flashlight again. Cool. Mary Jane is hungry, tired. Despite the dire circumstances, Timmy is very brave. Dolores is fine and well. I Okay. No, not not you, the uh, her. Yeah, might as well. Supplies are scarce and our moral is low. You can almost spell the desperation in the shelter. Pretty sure there is a small group of spies nearby, mostly old folks from the retirement home. Shouldn't be hard to borrow some of the supplies. No. No, you're not gonna do that. Hey, the kids back. I heard it. Robbing innocent people? No, we're not savages. We cannot stoop that low. Uh, and it's it's a shiny example. You just pick people alone. 
We found Cherry Cove back in our shelter this morning. We're not exactly sure why or how it came back. Is it a good care? F it appreciates our kind hearts, optimism, or just our stuffed pile of soup cans? Only time will tell. Mary Jane could use food. He's fine. Everything's fine with Dolores. Ted's fine. Uh, she needs a bit of food. And he's gonna die next round. You can go out. You don't need a gas mask. You can go with a flashlight. Wow, I did not do very well this time. Share a cop. I like that cat. It's probably gonna steal some of my food and run away. Mary Jane is hungry. Yeah. Timmy is needs water. Uh Ted needs water. Water both water. Trying to use no walk in the park, it won't get easier. We hope we're hopeful this will blow over soon and we'll be back to what it used to be, or else we might face dangers we've never dreamt of. When are the raiders gonna start showing up? The cat's there. He's still sick. He's probably gonna die soon. Mary Jane's hungry. Timmy is rested. Ted is pretty fatigued. Uh, it's hard not to worry. Yes. She's hungry, but you're not getting food. I need a health thing. Curiosity almost killed the cat. Sherikov found a tiny wire sticking out from the ceiling and pulled it out. Plaster and debris fell on the table, topped off with a big meowing furball. What is this thing anyway? Nobody remembers it being there before. The cat might be angry if you take away the wire. So maybe it's best just to leave it be, or should we examine that wire? We should examine the wire. Oh, but the cat's gonna be angry. The cat might be angry if we take away the wire, so maybe it is, it's best to leave a bee, or should we examine the wire? We should examine it, because I don't want the cat to die. I think the electric wire will probably shock the, everything under the cat. Hey, people are knocking at the door. We grabbed the cable and followed it to a rusty old truck parked in one of the neighbor's driveways. Upon opening the door, we were confronted by two men wearing huge headphones who looked extremely surprised to see us. They wiretapped our shelter when we were asleep and they were listening to everything we said. We gave them hell and marched back to our bunker. Okay, cool. Mary Jane doesn't eat anything. Timmy should eat. And Ted should also eat. 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 And the agents who were spying on us are now at the door and want to explain themselves. Yeah, we'll hear them out. He's probably gonna die. He's been sick for like 20 days. Okay, there were agents, real, live, secret agents on a government mission. We saw their identity cards, briefly. They weren't listening in on us, it was the cat they were interested in. They made a request to wanting us to aid them with some of their top secret missions in the future. If we do that, they promise they'll extract us to a government safe house full of supplies and donuts. Hopefully they come back soon with more information. Water, Mary Jane needs water, uh, water, what? okay, they all need water. Water, water, water. Everybody's getting water. Remember the time when Mary Jane went out to scare? Oh no! She had a wound on her forearm, but it looked like something bitter. Now the injury is looking much worse. Ah, can't do anything about it. Sorry, she's gonna die. He's gonna die, and that's how I'm gonna fail. Okay, Mary Jane will be fine. It's not the first time, and won't be the last time she's sick. She's looking a bit pale. Uh, everyone's okay. Either we get Ted medicine or we never see him eat another can of soup. Hurry. Yep, he's dying today. Oh, wow. Ooh, medicine. Two waters in exchange for... Oh, I don't have enough water. No! A woman came by cre with a creature she claims is a camel. Provided that camels have five legs. Okay, no. How much water do I have? I've got two water! Why can't I offer two water in exchange for a med pack? Oh. Uh, oh, uh, we give two water. Oh no, we give a med pack, med kit, and they give water. No, it sucks. Well, goodbye, Ted. You're dead now. Oh. Wow, he's still alive. That's hard to be. Why do I have ammo? 
think I'm close one. During one of its insane episodes at around 3, Shakarov ran face first into the wall, causing a loose brick to fall up behind it was a cigar box with ammunition. Um, maybe another time if you ever... Mary Jane is hungry. Mary Jane is tired. Nothing onto me. Okay. Who was hungry? Mary Jane. You're hungry. Uh, play a game. Nope. Uh, he's gonna die soon or later. Just die already. Just die. I can't. I don't have a med kid. A pair of strangers probably banded search the remains of a house above. We overheard them talking. One of them mentioned they captured a woman whose description matched Dolores. Ah, oh, okay. We don't think they'll let her go. We played through the day. When it turned out we. That we only kept asking questions, the most common ones. Are we going to eat anything besides tomato soup? We decided that's enough games. Okay, Mary Jane's thirsty. Water, water. Okay, you all need water. We didn't expect to get a phone call so soon after the atomic bomb, yet where we are, clearly a phone ringing outside must be the public phone booth on the other side of the street. Here, yeah, Timmy, you can go get it. Well, Ted dies. You say the end. Oh my word. Just die already. And onto the phone, we could clearly hear a gasp of relief from the caller. They introduced themselves survivors from the nearby town of Hill Valley. We had started exchanging information when the call was cut short. Something must have gone wrong on their side. We hope we'll get back to us. We were so afraid to swim, but he came back. Oh, he came back from the wasteland. Okay. Uh, everyone is okay except Ted, who's hungry and dying. Using a high-tech setup involved paper cut cups and yards of string. The agent rang in with an, our next top secret mission. They will surely lead us into the VIP bunker very soon. They want to go us uh, to go on one successful expedition and write down what we saw in the journal. Yeah, tell me you go. Die. Say that. Yes, finally the guy died. Yay, finally Ted's dead. We graciously agreed to fulfill their request. They thanked us for doing a civic duty and promised that they would be back with more information. Timmy can sneak like a secret agent man, but that might not be enough to avoid the band of raiders camp near our shelter. We can probably assume he isn't coming back. Oh, he's dead! Ted didn't sick far too long and he was too weak to keep on going. Okay, he's dead. Of all the places we could have perished, this is probably the best one. Or maybe not. 32 days! For my f f 32 days for my very first try, it's not like I didn't even make it to the bunker the first time, that didn't happen at all. I'm impressed I made it 32 days. The night to stay. Um, so when did he become sick? It, no, we didn't find... Uh, back. Okay, where's the mushrooms? Where did we get the mushrooms? We, um, Okay. Okay, oh well. Perished on day 32. Oh well. That was fun. I perished. Yes, five yeses and two noes. Water consumed. Soup consumed. Oh well. They survived. I survived 32 days on my first attempt in the bunker. Okay, so that was 60 seconds for me. I hope I, I beat this game because I want to see if it can be beat. And what I've seen, it can't. So, until next time, see ya.